activity plans, they are anything but typical for summer 2020. This makes it an at-home summer for all of us, and Studio 5 is designating it the year of the backyard. Outside areas will be our oasis for activity, and yes, even connection. Studio 5 creative contributor Liz Welker has some ideas for socializing in a new way. I think we have determined to make the most of it, right? My whole thing that I say is, it's better than nothing. <laughs> I just feel like everything I'm saying, any activity we get to do, any group we get to yeah. be with, it's better than nothing. So what's your approach for summer parties? I mean, we could talk about birthday parties, we could talk about swim parties, we could talk about the 4th of July, yeah. holidays coming down the pipe. What's yeah. going to be your approach for this year? I mean, I think it's just changing your expectations a bit is going to help you a ton. And then just doing things that make memories instead of worrying too much about the flash. And I, I mean, that's what my kids care about. Both of their birthdays were during isolation, and I think they'll remember them. I one, mean, it was weird. One party, yeah, different for sure. One party you're saying we're not going to back down from. We're going to lean yeah. in and make it work is the yeah. block party. Yeah. I mean, you have lots of space if you're outside in someone's backyard or just out in the street, and there's lots of fun ways to make it memorable. Hit me with some ideas to make a socially distanced gathering still special. Let's start with the decor. Okay. So I love this. This garland is made out of pool noodles, which you can get Stop. at the dollar store, right? Stop. So all you're doing is taking your pool noodles and slicing them into beads and then stringing them up. This is genius. And they make a big graphic statement. So when you're outside, you have lots of space to fill. So hang them on your deck, hang them on your fence, that sort of thing. So fun, and I mean, couldn't be cheaper. I was and it say, really fills the space. You can get these noodles for a buck at the yes. dollar store. And, and they're the, big and chunky, the so it takes there, up space. The space yes. is there, the texture's there. This is a genius idea. It's great, thank you. You, summer genius, 2020, <laughs> the pool you. noodle garland. Cool. That's it, I so love easy. It. These lanterns kind of fill in the Lanterns just from Oriental Trading and the dollar store. You can put fake tea lights in them if you're part at night but they are pennies to buy and just hang them up hang them everywhere tell me about some activities this is where it yeah. gets a little tricky when it comes to partying yeah. at a distance it is tricky okay over here this <laughs> huge connect four and huge jenga this set is, awesome. is so much fun right by my house in pleasant grove is a place called mort's rental okay m-o-r-t-s okay you can rent outdoor stuff like uh, boats and kayaks and camping gear and that or sort of stuff. Or you can rent Connect Four. Or Connect Four. So they have <laughs> yard games. And I mean, we borrowed this for this segment and I set up in my yard all the neighbors. It was like a magnet. Everybody's hanging over the fence watching yeah. us play. You can't not want to play. And they have lots of yard games. You rent them by the day or rent them by the week. Really affordable. Just have some hand sanitizer or uh, Lysol wipes around to wipe things off between players. But people can't help themselves when they see this outside. When you talk about the hand sanitizer or the yeah. Lysol, a supply station you yes. say will come in handy. So you have to deal with different elements, obviously, if you're right. going to be outside. So make everybody comfortable. If When the sun goes down, if my mom doesn't have a blanket on her lap, it's over. She's done partying. <laughs> so have a basket full of blankets. Have a basket full of sunscreen, bug spray, hand sanitizer, masks, um, anything that might p make people feel safer being together because outside. As a host, you're always willing to provide those things. You don't want to be the one that's going back and forth, back in the and house, forth. In the house, in the house. Just have it there and they can grab it. Have a bucket full of fun toys Smart. for the kids to grab. You're done. All right, treats. Let's talk to My favorite. Okay, my friends from Lollipuff Co Cotton Candy make these be they are artists. I mean, what is this? These are cotton candy <gasps> sculptures, okay? They will do porch parties for your neighborhood. They make 17 flavors. They say pink is not a flavor. These are real <laughs> flavors of cotton candy, and they can sculpt them into all these different designs that your kids could want. They bring their cute little cart over. Which they have they brought make them. to they our brought studio. Them. Look at them. They're fighting against some winds today, <laughs> but even winds cannot put down our it pineapple cotton candy. It is truly magical. You can book your porch party. They'll bring your cart, everything Thing. Your neighbors come up with a couple of dollars. Ask them for what they what they want to make. They'll make it for you. Amazing flavors. It's lollipop, lollipuff, L O L L I P U F F, cotton candy on Instagram. Are you kidding? They have a form there. You just fill out the form and say, I want you to come to my neighborhood, and they will come. I mean, that is the party at that point, and I love. Pink. It could be all you need. Just bring the cotton candy machine from Lollipuff, and what else do you really need? Pink is you not know? a flavor. Pink is not a flavor. Pink These are real flavors. They flavor. are artists. <gasps> I know. All I right. Gourmet cotton candy. Gourmet. We didn't even know it existed. But now we know a few little details, a few little ways you can punch home the details of your summer gatherings and your summer parties in a socially distant, safe way. Where can we get more ideas from you? Oh, you can find me at Pretty Life Girls on Instagram or prettylifegirls.com. Thanks so much. Website. We appreciate Thank you, you Liz.